how to control the temperature of a solar battery cabinet? There's two ways. First is using fan system or air conditioner, this kind of a normal cooling system. This, this has the, some weakness. First, the, the fan system is a mechanic parts. It get broken in two years or something. You have to make some maintenance rate. So on the side to swap it to make some maintenance is, is expensive. The air conditioner consume a lot of power, you know, and you are using the solar system. So if the solar system consumes power a lot from the air conditioner is not acceptable. So in the end, there's another way called a natural heat dissipation. So what our suggestion is when we design a solar battery cabinet, we should think about the, the devices put in the solar cabinet should be uh, industrial level and all in one design. Then plus the battery should be leasing battery. You cannot use lead acid battery because lead acid battery, the, the temperature range is like 25 degrees centigrade is the proper working, working temperature. But if you are using leasing battery, it, it could be 40 or 45 degrees centigrade working, working condition. So with that the design, now you have the natural heat dissipation uh, cabinet, which has good aluminum heat dissipator or something in outside. That could be a good choice for another way of cooling. This is how we control the temperature in our cabinet.